guys, Georgette here. Welcome back to the GA Rogers channel. And today I'm coming in with a fabric haul. Now most of these fabrics I did buy last year, but I have bought a couple within the past week. So let me show you what I got. The first one is a blue, it's a navy blue woven fabric. I'm not sure what this is. This actually came from Walmart, so I don't have the exact content. Um, or the exact wash instructions but it's a lightweight blue woven and it has a little stretch to it which is nice it's a little bit sheer I don't know if you guys can see that um, but I do think I oh also I have two yards of this the weight of the fabric I think is gonna make a really lovely dress but since I only have two yards of it um, it might end up being a skirt, but it does have a nice drape to it, and this hasn't been washed yet, so I'm sure when I wash it, well, I hope when I wash it, it'll get a little bit softer. But yes, I think this will make a lovely dress or skirt. And that is the first one. Now, next up are a few pieces that I got from Fashion Fabrics Club. Now, I bought these when they were running their 60% off sale. Now this sale only happens twice a year, so I do wait for the sale to happen, and then I try to get as much as I can. But unfortunately this time around, I only got a few. There are only a few that I liked. Or maybe that's fortunately, because I am going to do a de-stash very soon. Anyway, here are some of the fabrics that I picked up. Okay, so first up is this pumpkin orange shantung. It's not really picking up the color. Uh, but yeah, it could be a pumpkin orange. It's, let's see, I got, it was $2.70. I got two yards of it because I was thinking about making a skirt in this, maybe a button front skirt. So just a basic, but I think, I think it'll look really pretty once it's all made up. So yeah, that is the first one. Pumpkin Orange Shantung. Now the second fabric I got was this black floral drapery fabric. Now when I saw the words drapery, I thought this fabric was going to be more drapey. However, it's got a very stiff hand feel to it. Um, so it kind of messed up my plans a little bit because I was thinking about doing a dress in this. However, because it is so stiff, this is more like a pair of pants or even a lightweight jacket. Uh, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with this, but I do love the prints. I think it's really pretty. Um, I love a print. So the black floral was $3 a yard and I purchased two yards of this. So yep, that's the second fabric. The third fabric that I picked up was this purple stripe burnout. Now I thought this fabric was really cool because initially when I think of burnouts, I think that the print itself being a burnout and there's a floral print on this fabric. However, if you take a look, it's not the print that's burnt out. It has these stripes running down the fabric. That's the burnout. I thought that was really, really cool. It was very unexpected when I got it, and I actually like it a lot better like this than what I was expecting it to be. So, let's see, how many yards of this did I get? This was $1.98 a yard, and I picked up three yards of it because I knew it was going to be some type of dress. I have not decided which type because obviously I'm going to need a lining. <laughs> but yeah, that's destined to be a dress or a blouse. Probably a dress. That is number four. And the final fabric that I picked up from the sale was this gorgeous aqua blue. This is a floral fail. So this I just fell in love with when I saw it. And because this print is so huge, I'm thinking that this is going to be awesome as a maxi dress. 
a summer maxi dress, which is why I picked up, let's see, I picked up three yards of this fabric and it was $2.50 a yard. But I just love that drape and I love that color. In the summer, I think this is gonna be so awesome. That is fabric number four. And so those were all of the fabrics that I picked up from Fashion Fabrics Club. And then finally, I picked up a couple fabrics from Hobby Lobby. So first up is this cotton twill fabric. It's a printed fabric and the print on it, you can see there are a bunch of sloths just hanging out. I thought this was adorable. It's 100% cotton. It was $3 a yard and I picked it up to make another summer dress out of it. I thought this would be adorable as a summer dress and it's lightweight enough where I don't think it's going to be that heavy and because it's a natural fiber it should breathe. Now I have not washed this yet and I only got two yards because as you can see I got the last of the bolt. There was no more. So I'm really hoping I can eke a dress out of this especially because it's a directional print. I didn't even notice that, but all of these sloths are going in the same direction. So I'm hoping that I can eke out a nice summer, nice summer dress out of this fabric. And my final fabric from Hobby Lobby is this another cotton twill, but it's a floral print. I just thought this was so pretty. Now this is destined to become some kind of shorts or crop pants. Shorts, actually, because I only got, I think I only got two and a half yards of this or one and a half yards. I can't remember. But it's going to be a pair of shorts. Uh, again, this is 100% cotton. It was $3 a yard. They had a lot of this on the bolt, so I may go back and get a little more. Um, but yes, this will be a pair of shorts in the near future. So yeah, that is my haul. I'm so excited to add these pieces to my collection and I really can't wait to get into them and cut into them. Um, I do have a long list of things that need to be done first that need to be sewn up or mended, but hopefully I'll be able to get to these within 2020. <laughs> All right, guys, that is it for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more from the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and I will see you all next time. Bye!